This is David, WA9ONY. I have a Bofoing UV5R. And occasionally, it has a receive problem on 2 meters FM. Stations don't exist, just hear noise. But, if you go into the menu system, in fact, any place in the menu system, you hear the station's fine. Also, if you press the call button real briefly, normally you would go to FM mode, but you will hear the station just fine. And of course, this works as long as the station is transmitting, but as soon as it drops, it basically loses the station, and you have to press either the call button or menu. And also, you can press the start of frequency change, just press 1 in it, and you'll hear the station just fine. I've reset the receiver. Um, unfortunately, I lost 70 channels that were programmed into it. Next time, I'll use the uh, computer to program that. So this is probably the most uh, significant problem of the Wolfgang UV5R. It basically is receiver doesn't really function on 2 meter FM. Surprisingly, the NOAA weather station comes in just fine. But the FM stations, uh, 2 meter FM stations, for some reason, have this problem. Uh, printer paper. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I did. So, had a long enough experience to know that, yeah, it's man line, okay, I can do. But I never programmed, but I tried a little. World, and I can do that. Um, but uh, always ended up, most of the computer stuff gets down to can you get the setting? And that's kind of where I've, you know, I've gone from experience on that. So anyway, that VMC thing makes, you know, it's always silly to me thinking that you have this Raspberry Pi, which is the size of a credit card, and then you uh, you add a, a keyboard, a mouse, an external monitor, you know, a power cord and all that kind of stuff. And then, you know, all of a sudden it looks like a sprawled uh, uh, science experiment all over your desktop. And... Uh, I want to get rid of all the wires on it. That's that's my goal there, and uh, access it with your phone, and that works good. So I'm going to get a drip. Anyway, the new Raspbian Stretch comes with this real VNC, which is apparently a commercial product, but uh, you, all you have to do is check the box if you're using Raspbian. Um, now, if you don't have that, you can go to the real VNC company and download the server for it, but it, it comes with the Stretch thing. Like, is check the box, restart it, and then you load it on your uh, client computer. They give you a free client. Um, and uh, then, then you can run it on Windows or Macs or other Linux programs or whatever you like. Highs um, around to 75. Uh, then you switch over to the VNC once you got the address figured out. Anyway, I like that. So, um, I just played a little some of our emergency stuff that we do, and uh, you know, finding that, that it, it works reasonably well. Um, and um, there's other ones I want to learn about too, like the Adroid, and uh, looks like a very powerful one. It might even work better than the Pi, and it flows around 60.
put it out for you. And the camera, if you smile, it goes green. If you frown, it goes. Confirm. Anyway. Uh... One. Oh, maybe I could identify these hemp plants so I could differentiate between a true hemp plant and a look-alike that's got rounded leaves instead of serrated leaves, or a weed that looks like a hemp. The book playing UV5R received problem 2 meter FM has occurred once before and then magically disappeared. Today it's more persistent and it basically is occurring for the last several hours and I'm not aware of how to fix it. We've reset the uh, receiver, we tried different channels, uh, we tried um, using the memory mode versus the VFO mode. We've um, incremented the frequency up and down. I think one time in doing that, uh, incrementing the frequency up and back to the original frequency actually got it to work once. So this is probably the major problem with the Wolfgang UV5R that would prevent uh, me recommending it to um, anybody because once you're in this mode, it's really kind of useless for 2 meter FM. This is David, W9 online, 73 and QRT.